All right, we are now going to do some golden gear. We're going to do some conundrum 12, and we're going to see if we can get this done this time. Hopefully we can. Um, I... How do I put this? We have tried so many, so many times to get this done with Propagation Path, and I'm still going to do that. We are, we are going, we are going to get this done. Um, this time instead of Ron May, we're gonna be using Silver. I'm practicing a little bit. I haven't, I haven't still declared it, but I feel like, um, I feel like we need uh, the defense down and stuff from like Ron, from the Vasilov, or even even Pella would work too. Um, but adding, being able to add an element, roll and add an element is good. It's better than what Ron May is giving us currently because Ron May gives us pen damage and she gives us the 20% defense down as well. But I feel like adding an element is just, it just feels better. But then again, like we've been doing this the whole time and it's not been working. Unfortunately, that's the problem. So like trying the same thing over and over, but, uh, you know what? We'll, we'll go with the class. We'll start out with the classic today. We'll start out with the classic today. We'll start out with the classic today. Because my roommate does also bring defense down, so I guess actually the difference is there, but she brings more. It's so whatever. Um, I'm just want to get it cleared. You know what I'm saying? Like I've been trying so hard to get these propagation clears, and it's been frankly a nightmare. It's been an absolute nightmare. We'll take the achieve attempts. Sound with this, ooh, that's a little, little too loud. Big down to six. There we go. Like aggro me. Aggro. Why didn't you aggro as well? Aggro. There you go. You aggro as well. There you go. I want to get all three of them at the same time. So you get as much damage in as possible. I'm gonna put it on auto because I have it currently. I currently have it set so that uh, uh, I will not have. That's not worth. There we go. So we'll extra music in the background. Free skill point of character consumes character restores HP equal to 100 percent of their max HP. Yep. Propagation, propagation. We'll take some max HP. Cool. We're gonna cheat right off the back. Uh, select one domain, copy the select domain to two random locations. It's actually really good. We're gonna take this one. Hopefully it copies, and that tells us exactly where to go. So boom, 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 right? To get the most out of our our kit here. Sound Eternal. All will be swept away by the wind. Turn the auto battle off. Okay. Oh, they got the immediate hit. I just realized that. That's right. These elite fights are gonna have the immediate hit. But actually, don't have to worry about this. Never mind. Perfect. Um, same character moving, getting more attack is actually really good. Getting another cheat attempt is really good. That'll be really good for us in the future. And the main reason I'm recording this whole run is because I, I want to upload the whole thing so we can see exactly how this all worked out, right? Oh, we went the wrong direction. No, my elite. Oh, my elite two just moved here. Oh, perfect. That's actually okay. That actually is great. That is fantastic. Okay. We're gonna start hers, and I think we're just going to open up, and then we're gonna open up with this as well, and then we'll open up with the five million attack. This might actually do the big damage again. I'm not sure. I don't think so. No, it did not. Turn the turn the off battle off. There we go. There we go. Heaven search. Price. All things in this world have human creation. Wow, nobody nobody's betting. Wow, that's crazy. Okay, well you know it's fine. Nobody gets any points. Nobody gets no bets. 
I would do this all. It would focus on me getting this shit done. I came together. I'm scared. Stay put. Give me strength. Some value, I suppose. Like at most, we will end up using a like. The disassociation like cards if we get them, right? But we're not doing, um, we're not doing any of the, we're not doing any like buying the shop strats or remembrance for like you know full remembrance or anything along those lines. Because you can always get those cards outside of it anyways. But the main focus is propagation. If we get those dissociation cards would be re we would be really happy about that. Though. Be really happy. Really happy about it. Strength. Yeah, I know. Pones. Pones is the only one. It's okay. It's all good. That was an alarm. I don't know why there's a random alarm going off. It's fine. Big stuff, big stuff, big stuff, big stuff. Hopefully, we get some good buffs from this. Remember, my Daniel is E2, so I do get extra turns whenever an extra, an action event, an extra turn, and more damage when, um, Arm going off because you needed to snap back to reality. No, 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 no. I'm gonna cheat. Yeah, it sounds like no one ever watched. Wonder Man. No, not that one. Oh God. Oh, I needed that. We well, you know we're not gonna fucking care about it. Let's just go. I also selected the wrong cheat, anyways. I wanted to select the one that allows me to like pick a place and just take it. Caution does not mean Okay, this is perfect. Take that. Uh, we'll start this fight with Quantum. This is good. 2x bonus. 2x bosses. That's totally fine. We got this. We got this. It's fine. We got it. It's fine. Would have been nice to have a uh, Silver Wolf for this fight, but that's okay. Let's do this. So, if I don't have the propagation buff, we're going to do is generate a skill point, then use an ultimate. We're going to focus on her first. Thankfully, he's not like the bugged one, so it's okay. She is the one who attack punishes. So. Every petal all will be swept away by the wind. It's all good. Stay close. Here stands the silver main guard. Hold everyone back again. Get them. Yeah. Heaven search. He's gonna get hit, but that's okay. That's good. Ultimate from Pohua, which will give us the max bonus with that. Give us the max bonus with this. Uh, which will actually allow us to do this. Cool. And keep focusing on her, and we keep focusing her down. There's more to life. We are good. Eternal. This is the turn of generating skills. Breaking. All that jazz. This is fine. 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 I can do this. Oh, and you generate the skill point. I sent a store to heaven's search. So, full set. Nice. Uh, reply. Okay, good. Some value, I. <laughs> Every petal all will be swept away by the wind. Um, skill point generation. Perfect. World cleansing dragon. Dragon into. No, we're gonna hold skill. So that'll be a turn to heal. Plus energy regeneration. Anything to do a full kit without it. Awesome. 225. Awesome. Dead. 
And then basic. That's fine. That's fine if I throws. We cast this. Hit this before he goes into that state. Bam. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Um, we're gonna go ahead and get to a skill point. Because we gotta refresh a lot of things. And then he'll go. She'll get, he'll get delayed and then we'll get to go. Yeah. We'll do this. Full combo. Into a full combo. Or into the ultimate. Into a full combo. Yep. Played that very well. Every petal all will be swept away by the wind. Casting all. I think he was already delayed once by the ult, but that's fine. Not a step back. He gets that counter from the previous iteration, and then we just blow it on. She doesn't care. Hold back again. And then just basic. Oh, we got him! We got him! We got through the two the two X elite boss. Um, no. Yes. Yes. And there should be another set. Um, I'll take the weakness break delaying enemy action. We won't great fully because we don't we don't guarantee freezes right now. Though then again, there is the uh, the propagation I think crossover with. Fully. Gosh, I probably should, I probably should have took that because there is the um, oh, I should have took that because there is the interplay that actually will freeze targets with basic attacks. Low chance, but it will. So, hmm. uh, turn onto the select domain and apply the knowledge effect. Um, confirm target, so I can just go this way and do that. Yeah, I'll just, yeah, I'll just go this way and get two X's twice. Two X elites twice. Oh, but the fucking, the fucking Curio changed it into a one. Are you kidding me right now? I think, I think it changed it into a one. We'll find out, I guess. Probably gonna change it into a one. There was also a, what should we call it back there that I should have grabbed? It's fine. Oh wait, no, so it is still two. Okay. I don't know why I thought it was going to be one, because the last one was only one there. Okay. Panic is going to be Calm down. Right. Um, basic. Basic into ultimate. Fire dude might be a problem, but avoid the ultimate problem. So you can break it. Actually have, her, actually, have them attacking the other guy so they can slowly break him down. Ultimate from Fushuan from Pohua to get the All ultimate from Fushuan. Which is good. Basic over here. He's gonna get delayed. He didn't get delayed. Oh, her ultimate wasn't up yet. Did not have the energy the for it. Unfortunate. This is unfortunate. Her basic attack over here. His triple punch basic attack over here. Should get enough energy for his ult? No. Okay. She will refresh her skill, which gives us effect reses. Now he has enough energy for his ult, which will give him an immediate turn. Should give him a full punch, which will break this guy. Perfect. And then Ho Ho will continue to generate because we don't really need the healing. She will basic attack this guy. She will basic attack this guy for the quantum break. Switch back over to him for a full punch. Ho Ho still doesn't really need to heal because she has two stacks of uh, Fushon has two stacks of her passive, so it's basic. And then we re pop her buff. Basic over Every here. Pop, pop with Ron May's the ultimate. Because I don't think either of them been delayed yet, but they might might have. Yep. They were just they had the gate just been delayed. I'm horrible at tracking that. Um, I do not have enough for his punch. However, um, I'm gonna do two. I might get enough. Oh, he's almost dead. Ha, ah, yes, I will get enough because I'll get Hohoa's energy from his. Perfect. We will do her ultimate first because it might just kill him, which is fine. And then 
we will do her basic over here. We're actually going to do the ultimate on the main guy, because that guy will die to the secondary damage from a full punch, I believe. Or a full, full dragon. From the break in the full dragon, he'll die. Uh, refresh two forms buff. Keep basic attacking with full full. Keep basic attacking her. Recast her ultimates again. I'm sure it's always up. There's like basically no reason to never, like, to ever not cast Ron Nice. Uh, generating a skill. Use the dragon again. And then... Good water. Awesome. Basic. One more skill. One skill point attack. Um, yes. This is really good, but this is even better. Weakness break with association. That's going to help our damage a lot. Really should have took that fully now. I really hate that I didn't take that fully. Oh, scythe limbs. Yes, so this uh, extra damage based on skill points, extra skill points consumed. And then fungal parasite as well? Oh, okay. Oh, there was two bosses. That's right. Awesome. Fantastic. This 2x is so good. Um, could I put that somewhere else? I could technically... I could technically... I could technically cheat and put it up here and get two more fights before I get here. And then I'd have to, like, run across in the next domain. I think boss and turn into a combat domain. You know what? I think I might do that. No, 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 I could cheat and... Yeah, so I, what I want to do is cheat and get... Really copy the current domain and the second domain implied knowledge effect. Yeah, I want to get this. Cheat, get this. And then select the known domain, select boss, maybe copy the current domain onto it. Yeah, so it'd be a 2x, yeah, cool. So all these 2x elites right before I get to the end, so like double curios, double buffs, like, like a ton of buffs right now. This is actually like such a great, such a great round, roundup. Caution does not mean cowardice. Now we are low on these, the technique points, so... Oh, this is gonna get rough real fast. We're gonna try to make this as easy as possible though. Raw May technique is the best technique for this situation. I probably should have only been using her technique. This is gonna be a rough. This is gonna be a re these two bosses together. This is gonna be a rough fight. Oh god! Because I do not have removal, and I need to kill these. Otherwise, we will just die. Does that mean I kill him first and just let him kind of rampage around? Fool! You can't play dead. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this basic attack. Oh, I meant to. Shouldn't have waited. Should have waited on that. Should have waited on that. Should have done Ron Maze first. Okay, we'll do this. And Ron Maze. We do a full punch from him. And we do his ultimate. There's at least one of them. And the other one. Cool. Then we do a full punch over here. And again, focusing him down probably would have been better, honestly. Let's get those skill points back. Give him another turn after her. Get her buff up. Should have waited for her buff to do all that. She realized that, that was kind of dumb. I already know that's the strategy for that too when I don't have her pre buff up, so. Uh, frankly, even though I got the whatchamacallit, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna do this. Yeah, I think we can just we can hold off on that. Maybe be taunting anyways. Have her basic attack over here. Have... Honestly, it's okay if he attacks again. We got spores going around as well, so it's okay. Yeah, she's fine. She's totally fine. It's totally fine. We're gonna focus on the big dude. But she's the only one using her skill right now, so it's fine. 
Oh my god, that was not... Yeah, no, I forgot that he does that. He does the AoE hit. That's right. No, I can He has to die first. He has to die first because that shit's gonna... That shit will kill us. Straight up. No if, hand, or but about it. That will kill us. Cast her skill during not his turn. Um, I'm gonna generate a skill point here. Because I have a feeling he's gonna summon the dudes. Yeah, detonation order. Yep, 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 yep. And that's when we wait. We wait for him to wake up. And then we do this. We use his full combo here. Just put him in on it. Okay. We use Hoho's skill. We use Hoho's bolt. We use Kokos or Ron Mazolt. Then we use all things in this world. Sri Schwan's ult. And then break that guy. It came together. Refresh. Immediately get the skill points back and all that stuff for this. Kill this dude. Yeah. Awesome. Perfect. He gets delayed. Bokoi does the basic. He gets delayed murder. We use Daniel's ultimate. And then a full combo. Let's go. Let's go! All right, cool, perfect. Um, carries effect res, apply to adjacent enemies. Yes, that's actually really good for us. Randomly enhances two blessings after getting this carry up. Reduces the price for shop items and dread addiction domains. Let's go with that because we might actually it might actually be important. Um, for each blessing of abundance, we get more HP. That's actually really good. We need more HP. We need also the interplay with abundance because I believe the interplays with this are abundance and are abundance and yeah and this so metamorphosis status deals twenty percent more damage per minute just on the attack of terror such as to freeze hit target by one turn and then heals target for ally fifty percent yeah so we need abundance and we need oh uh, we do need fully stuff so we copy this like domain to two random locations on the current roll I mean we already we already have that so it doesn't really matter but we'll do it. We'll copy this one over down here because there would have been that much extra. I'm not even worrying about this now. There's just no point. We're gonna have to make a beeline across though, <laughs> like a straight beeline. Oh, this is this is gonna be rough. Uh, we'll open up with imaginary. Okay, this is gonna be this is gonna be so annoying. That guy, I think we can handle. No matter who he hits, I think we can handle him. This guy is actually a problem though. And these guys are problems. They hit so fucking hard. Like, this might wipe us. We might wipe here. Like, absolutely. It's totally 100% possible that we just fucking lose right here. Thankfully, they're both imaginary weak, and that's, like, our biggest benefit right now. I have a feeling I'm going to have to limit myself to two skill points from Daniel during this fight. Yeah, I'm going to need to limit myself to two skill points from Daniel during this fight. Yeah, 100%. I need, to, I need the skill points. I just straight up, I just straight up need them. Because I'm going to need to be able to use Fuchuan's heal more. So we're going to have to limit ourselves to like two skill points for Daniel. So if we have two, we use it, right? We can do this. No, I need to kill him. So if we have his ultimate up, obviously we use three for a full, a full punch. And then... Her basic. And then I want Wolf Horse skill up right now, so I'm just gonna have to go with it. At least we can go as many as possible. I know it's a certain one because it's cold. Um, skill point. Skill point into Metamorphosis. Two skill points. Yeah, there we go. And then we do this. We basically limit ourselves on Daniel to two skill points so that we never have, like, an issue. 
right? That's basically the way. Unless he has the three punch, we limit him to two skill points. Yeah, that worked out. That worked out pretty well. Okay, now we're good. Now we can go back to three skill points if we need to. That actually, he actually killed him way faster than I was expecting. I was actually really worried about that, I'm not gonna lie. But he never got a chance to do any of his big shit because, uh, we're just too good. We're just too good. Too good. I do obviously have more of the path, like the, the path level up ability stuff, like more path damage, more stats, etc. At this point, because I have been running this to try to get it, because I've I need it now. It was just, it was not possible before. When Sax reaches the enemy point, this is Larry Pitchman. This first time this battle, there's a chance to freeze the enemy. You know what? I'll take that. Um, the cure that has been destroyed. There's one cure that's been destroyed. <laughs> Getting a free blessing Risa is really good. Uh, increase the damage taken by enemies with dissociation by 35%. The effect will remain for one turn after the dissociation. Critical space attack crit rate. I want that crit rate. I, w I want that, but I also want this. If it was the one that removed when it when you it automatically removed dissociation, I would have probably done it. But oh, this would have been nice to have at some point. We'll forfeit it. It's fine. We have a lot. We have so so many things for like a transaction domain if we ever get there. All right, what's our first enemy? Okay, we can fight this, this one, and it'll automatically add. Imaginary weakness to whatever enemy we're facing, which is totally worth it if for some reason we end up against fucking um, Argenti again, Caution which is goddamn AoE. Cowardice. The first character we're gonna grab, I think, this time actually is it's gonna be Silverwolf into Japard, just in case we need to switch out Pushwan for Japard. We once again don't really have an army technique points, which is unfortunate. I gotta remember to save those better. A bit more after this. Every petal will be swept away by the wind. Uh, thing up yet. Awaken, dormant scale. We're gonna do this now. Dragon. We're gonna get us some damage in. Yeah. Yeah, bro. Yeah. Oh, it's just her. Oh, but her skill's not up. Let's do this. Her skill's not up either. This is going to be a lot of damage that just comes out right now. Yeah, let's do this. We're dead. We're probably going to die, actually. There's a, there's a pretty damn good chance we actually die here. Two punch. Oh, we're gonna, okay, we're good. We're good. We're reducing that damage a lot. Ooh, it only went on two targets, but, but that was still good. That was still good. That was still really good. That worked actually in our favor, in my opinion. Okay, 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 we're doing good. We're doing good. We're doing good. Oh, that's good. We're good. Okay, 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 okay. okay. That's good. Generating skill point. Generating skill point. Generating skill point, then use her ult. Use push one ult as well to get uh, her passive back, just in case. She goes so fast after she casts that. I wonder if it advances her action forward or something. It feels like it does with the way she just almost immediately gets to cast it. Oh. Rough. That's the buff. Pekros. Yep. Basic. You're going to limit him to one this time. I thought she would die. She didn't die. That's okay. You did. Cool. We got her. Um. No, these are both really good. Charger, 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 Imperial Rain. I don't think I really need any more Imperial Rain though. Fighting Spirit gives you defense, right? Yeah. I think the charging of the Dewdrop is actually really good for us. Oh, Space Time Prism. Yes, let's go. That's super good. That's super super good. That's super super good. Okay, cool. That put so that puts that puts. Ho Ho at E1, Fushwan at E1, 
Ron May at E at E2, and Daniel at E3. That is that is so good. That's so good. All right, we just have we really have to focus on not fucking this up. We need to just make a B, we just need to make a beeline to the end. Just like take whatever we can and get straight to the end as fast as possible. Unfortunately, there is not a straight path. There is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight exactly in our way. That is unfortunate. Um, I will take losing energy equal to max energy. That's that's actually fine. It's actually not that big of a deal, honestly. It's terrible, but it's like out of all of them, it's like the worst of them all. It's not the. It's, I'd rather not lose two skill points. Thank you very much. Uh yes, upgrade two blessings. Awesome. And Flowing Mist, which actually gives us extra skill points, has a chance to give us extra skill points. Let's go with that. Let's go. I mean, during the current moment, attain one blessing. Um, I believe I'm not going into combat this time. I'm going to an adventure zone, but you know what? That's fine. I'm going to save my rerolls for when I really, really need them. We are just going straight ahead, though. This actually gives us another downloader as well, which actually means we can grab uh, Japard right now, which actually works out. That works out great. Oh, the dodge one. We can dodge. We we use we use Ronmei. We thought we use Ronmei's dodging skills. Dodge. Ronmei dodge. Oh wait, no, it's not good. Either. Ooh, that was close. All of a sudden, I was like, wait, it's not good. Actually, this is fine. Ooh, that was close. Never actually failed at this one. This is probably one of the easiest ones. But one of these days I probably will. Because I'll just like miss something. That another adventure up there for when we get there. Right, blessing Trotter. We're st that means we're still gonna end up facing the end boss with like at like plus four or plus three of uh, what we call it. So, so all right, we're gonna do this. Start with imaginary. The reason one of the reasons Ron May's is effect is so good is because it immediately applies both the whatever your like it allows you to weakness break the enemy immediately with whoever you attack with basically. Super good. Oh, we actually need to do a ton of damage to him because the Trotter will, will kill itself trying to heal him. Oh, I should have killed him. Some value, I suppose. I sent a storm. Heaven's search. Great. the Trotter. Because the Trotter won't heal itself, so never mind. Be back. Um, I want to break the Trotter. I don't want the Trotter getting a turn. I don't really care if this guy comes out of whatever he's in. I don't want the Trotter getting a turn. There's more to life. Existence is unity. Every petal in life's garden all will be swept away by the wind. He's fine. We're good. Heaven's surface. His ability first. I sent a storm. Uh, generator skill point. Awaken, dormant skin. World cleansing dragon. We will use this. Heaven, sir. Trotter. Come on, go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Uh, finally, we'll pop it, Rob. Chris P. Bacon. That's right. Trotter should just die. The side damage. Cool. So one of the one of the best parts about Ron May, right? Is she makes it so that if your other character, like your main primary damage, isn't the um, isn't the breaking character, isn't the one that reduces toughness. 
your other character, if your other characters are like your, your, like in this case, my healer and my preservation character, they can still end up breaking the character. And since, since they have higher efficiency, their their basic Conflict attacks actually will break focus. the character, like will All break the enemy. She works. That makes her work really well with like offensive supports like Fushuan and Lotra. That's an example. Cleansing dragon. Heaven search. Rise. Quick divination. I'm just gonna There's more going. to So we get the uh, so we get that cleanse. Existence is meaningful. Every petal in life's goal will be swept away by the wind. Ultimate. I know Fushuan's gonna have to recast her ultimate, which will give. Looking ahead on the turn order, we're good. Yeah. Let's go. Boom. Nice. I see through you. Converge and awaken. Basic. Basic. One, one skill. Give him an energy. Cleansing dragon. <laughs> Ooh, this run's going okay. This run's going pretty good. This run's going pretty good right now. Let's, let's, let's not let's not lose it yet. Basic. Oh, he's not gonna break. That's nice. But you know he will break too. He'll break to this. And we definitely want a quantum break, so we get the quantum break damage. I actually would like. I really wish I had more break effect on uh, Bujuan because of how many times she actually can break it. Grace and elegance. Bujuan ultimate did not give me enough, but you know what? This will. So we do that. All will be swept away by the wind. Comes our skill point now. We could afford to use two skill points for this. And the we ultimate. The I think one of the biggest things for me and Daniel is learning how to like not actually always go for three skills. Like you can definitely afford, um, because of the way his ultimate works at E2, I can afford to just not sometimes and, uh, go with uh, go with whatever we got. Oh, we're basically that killed with the spores. Nice. Um, no. Um, no. Ooh. brings us to remove from the character. That's actually really good because there's a lot of debuffs that come out. Attack does quick damage. The character's current shield. That'll be really good if we had Japard on the team, but it's not enough. Um, I'm gonna go for this one because that's really good. We're gonna hit a transaction domain, I think, at some point on the list here. Yeah, we could technically go up, and we'll definitely hit. Hmm. Let's see, one, two, three, four in here. One, two, three, four here. So either way we go, we actually could hit the transaction domain. You know what? We're gonna take this. Let's go with this. Clue boss and turn into a combat domain. You know what? Um, I'm gonna do it on this one because I actually kind of want to hit this because it doesn't really matter what my entry is right now. Um, I want what the rewards you get for going into an intro, which are usually either a cheat or increased time on the countdown, right? So I don't, I don't really care. We'll just increase the intro. It doesn't matter right now, right? Um, repair one damage curio. Um, that is only that one, which I don't really want to repair. Um. So I'll gain, the, I'll gain the three dice roll attempts. Because what I can do, so let me copy the current demand of the selected domain. No, 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 I don't want that. Um, I want to reroll. Select one domain, copy the selected domain to two random locations on the map. Okay. Um, I'm going to select this one and hope to God it does not hit that transaction one. Okay. Okay. So 
the next time we reroll, right? We're gonna go here. The next time we reroll, this is a mutation. This called me a wipe last time. So the next time, so what we're gonna try to do is reroll into one of those ones that allows us to select something here afterwards and hopefully get even more rewards off of this and just just bank, right? So mutation, this is gonna be it's gonna be kind of rough. But we have buffs again, so we're just gonna go ahead and fucking we're just gonna go ahead and fucking use them. We're gonna go ahead and fucking use them. Um, I'm even gonna use titles, but I'm gonna start the fight with Daniel. We're gonna use them. We gotta use everything, everything we've got here. All right, we can do this. I believe. Uh, I'm actually gonna go ahead and do this, so that it's just up. Basic. Full skill combo into basic. He's frozen. Stays frozen for a bit. Another basic. Another basic. We're gonna do two, two. Save the skill points. A quick divination. Because Fushuan has to recast her skill. Ronmei is gonna have to recast her skill as well. Some value, I speak this community. Every petal all will be swept away by the wind. And then he's gonna use one basic. It's not gonna give him enough energy. She's gonna use one basic. Then she's gonna use her ultimate. She's gonna break a couple characters. Actually, then we're gonna use uh, the swarm. My more is this. She'll give us a full punch, which we will do a full punch with this. Because then we can get the ultimate. Which will give us another full punch. Which gets us through both of their heals. Gets, which means he never got a chance to heal, which is the best fucking part about that. Um, I want these up. I'm going to use her heal even though it doesn't heal anybody because I want to use her ultimate. Basic. Basic. Sense of storm. I kind of want a full punch. I kind of want a full punch. We're going to full punch. Basic. Ooh, he's almost dead. She's got to recast her buff. He can do one skill, which should kill. It did not. It did not kill, but he got delayed. He to use ultimate. Let's go! Holy shit. Holy shit, okay. Um, I'm gonna take that because we still hadn't gotten this. There we go. Um, and I'm gonna take this. Perfect, which we should get this. And finally gives us the interplay for the healing one as well. We do not have a lot of propagation buffs. It's fine, we have a lot of like combinations of buffs. I can clearly copy the current domain onto the selected domain and apply the knowledge effect. Ooh, this is so good. Okay, um, it means I don't actually have to go up. We can just we can just turn this one into this. Go there, cheat to get this one down here. Perfect. And then go into the transaction domain, buy a bunch of shit, and uh, yeah. Now we don't have all of the buffs this time, so this this guy also can't be frozen. <laughs> We are fucked. We are so fucked. We are so fucked. This is we're gonna wipe here. I have a feeling we're gonna wipe here. Of course, we got a boss that could not be frozen. So dissociation is not gonna help us here, like at all. Th look at the damage. We hadn't had what's call it up yet, but holy shit, look at that damage. All right, yeah, this is definitely a Daniel does not use skill points yet. We need to buff up. Do this. He doesn't even have all the buffs. I don't know why I did that because we don't even have all his buffs yet. So not, not really a good idea, but you know what? It's fine. Get as much damage as possible. And uh, basic. So much damage. So much damage. Look at that damage. It's so much damage. We have to go so fast. It's so much damage. She already popped one of her skills. It's so terrible. This is definitely going to be a um, a slow roll. I'm gonna I'm gonna hold on to his uh what I call it for the moment. I'm going to pop her skill again, because I need her to get energy as fast as possible. 
um, to get that buff back up so that she doesn't just straight up fucking die. The goal will be to quantum break her if possible. Break the enemy if possible. Because that, that ice AoE is just going to shred through us. Look at that. Every time because of that, she just dies. It's so rough. Um, yeah, I need the energy. Literally, that's how we survive. We need the energy. Okay, we can pre-punch with this. Because we had it up. We're going to use her skill again. We need her basic attack. We're going to use his basic attack. And then I'm going to use this on him. To get in like a good round of attacks. With some skill points. And then I actually did it in the wrong order, but that's okay. We're going to hit him again. Get another ultimate. And there's ice. Look at that, see? Um, we're going to have to do this because we need to cast her skill again. She will heal from it, so she will not She will not immediately pop it again, so we're good. Um, she'll do her basic. She'll do her skill. Uh, Fushuan will do her basic and quantum break. Yes, this is exactly what we want. We're going to go ahead and we're going to pop Ron May's ult here with the penetration. Hit this guy with as much as we can. Um, basic. Build our basics back up, right? Use our ultimate here. While he's broken, we're trying to hit him as much as possible. Oh, we were like two energy short for Daniel's ultimate again. Oh, um... You know what? We will use her skill. Make sure we get enough energy. We will use Daniel's basic attack, which will give him enough energy for an ultimate. We do that, then we get a full punch on him. We may even get enough for... We did not. There's the path. We're going to go ahead and cast this. We're not going to get the full skill points for it, but I want to hit him again. Look at that damage. Look at that damage. We're going to... Two points. Just two. We're going to go for two because we need to do Hohua's Ho Ho skill again to make sure we have the cleansing and the healing on, on every turn. Right? We need all of it. Okay? We're going to do this again because we need this. Unfortunately, enrage, like the Enrage Timer is a real, might be a real problem on this if we're not careful. Um, how many... How much energy is it? It's hard to see because I have my number pad buttons here. I wish they, I wish it, they weren't like massive, basically. It's kind of hard to see, like, it, over, it covers it when the character is the one going, basically. Um, Ron May is going to need to cast her uh, skill again on this next turn. So we're going to use two skill points. Fushuan will be fine, I think. Oh, this is perfect. We wait. Okay, she got, she got her ability again. Ron May needs to recast her. Oh, yeah, I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have done that. I should have waited. I should have waited. Damn. All right. So Ron May will cast her ability. I should have used her ult first. That was a mistake. We're making like slaves. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. We made slight mistakes. Already made two mistakes. It's not good. Wait, we got a skill point still. We're gonna cast this. We're gonna basic with Wolf Wolf. We're gonna basic with him and then cast his ult. But I casted Wolf Wolf first. This was that was terrible. Was a third mistake. Three mistakes. Three mistakes, it's gonna it's gonna cost us that, that energy not having that energy will cost me later. I know it. Uh let's see. Triple Dragon. Alright, we're gonna do Metamorphosis. And we're gonna do her basic. We're gonna do No, we're not gonna do we're gonna do two punch. Two punch. Two punch. Two punch. Two punch damage. Uh, we gotta cast her skill again. We can use her ultimate. Nope. And then we have to cast her skill again so we have all the cleanses. Yeah, if I wasn't doing that with Fushuan, we would have died by now. It's so, it's so key to make sure she gets that passive back up. Holy shit. Woo! Who would have known this fight would be the hardest? I did. I literally said it right before the fight uh, started. I'm going to do one skill because we should get enough for his ultimate, which we will immediately use. And then do a three skill. So yeah, limiting. Gather as one. 
limiting Daniel to two every now and then, and then, uh, then just spamming Fushwan's skill to make sure she always has the energy to cast a roll to get that pro get that passive back up is super fucking important. Because otherwise she just dies outright, and it's and it's terrible. Um, she should have enough energy through a basic attack to actually get it up. So I think I'm just gonna three punch this and try and end it right here. Cool. That shit was rough. Um, I like this, but not... I like it. I like it. I'll take it. It's it's good action forward. Um, how many broken carriers do I have now? One. But if I go into an incurrence at some point, it's more damage. Um, I don't want random blessings because I could end up with the original call, so I'll just take that one since it's technically destroyed. And then copy the selected domain to two random locations on the current plane, apply knowledge to them. No, my transaction domain! I should have I should why did I knew what my plan was and I totally ignored my plan. That was that was terrible. That was dumb. That was really dumb. I totally ignored my plan. That was that was not good. I totally ignored my transaction domain. Because I've got like 1481 of these things. Yeah, the mistakes are piling up. Those small mistakes, they're piling up. They're piling up. It's terrible. They're piling up. All right. All right, whatever. <sighs> okay, here we go. We are not healed at all. This is going to be really rough. Okay, we healed immediately when the fight started. She's getting a turn. Oh my god, they deal so much damage. What the fuck? What am I doing? Why am I doing this? This is a terrible idea. Why did I do that? I should have just gone to the adventure one. Um, do a basic attack. Into this. Should have waited for Fushuan to go so I would have had her skill. Um, that's unfortunate. Oh, go. Go, go for three. Help her skill. Yep. This is the same this is the same case scenario where I need to kill these ads right away. Stay put. Thankfully this enemy is imaginary weak, so we will have less problems with this. I'm gonna use our basic attack over here. Every petal Pop that will be swept away by the wind. We are close to an ultimate here, so I'm gonna do I'm gonna do a two. Yeah, I'm gonna do a two first. Because that breaks this gives us a turn. Will she survive a turn? I feel like I need to use her skill. Give that energy. Yeah. Use her skill. Use his ultimate. Free punch because we have all the all the abilities. Hoa doesn't need to heal at the moment, but good. Hoa can break her. Thankfully, these target these targets can be frozen. Basic Some value, here. I suppose. Ooh. Eternal. Skill. A quick divination. Um, basic, but. Daniel. And then we do a two punch with him. Yeah. Good damage. She gets delayed. She dies. She immediately goes. Okay, that's not good. That's fine. She's something we're gonna add. That's fine. Um, basic. Let's get that break. Basic over here. I think we do a two punch again. Pretty sure we get enough. No, we did not get enough energy. Ooh, but he gets another turn. Basic? Yes. Let's go. Because of the uh the the consecutive attacks. Cool. Um we're gonna pop her skill again. One so she heals. And then um we want to hit her. But that was for me. We're gonna free punch. But I shouldn't have Oh no, because he had his ult. That's right. It was a free punch of his ult. Da, da, da. That's a fly punch. We repop her skill. 
Pop run these ults. Pop. Ho ho's ults. And then we pop Fushuan's ult again because we we just need we need as many stacks of her passive as possible so that we can be not necessarily reckless, but so we can play a little easier. These freezes and all that stuff is helping us a lot. This is helping us a ton. All right, we can generate. Just do basic attacks right now. Just more basic attacks is fine. We can do three points. I think. Yeah, we can do three. Points. Especially because I can do this. And then this. Yes, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. 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 Um. Oh, that's really good. After association is moved, uh, fifty percent chance of freeze. HP reduces the damage they take when a character provides a shield. Uh fifty percent chance of energy freeze. No, you know what? No, let's move. Let's try, try something different. No, I don't like that one either. Let's try to reset something different. When being healed by an ally, characters restore extra equal to the amount healed. Characters gain five percent attack. Crit rate. I don't need the crit rate. I'll take the. I'll take the heal. Um, I'll take the rerolls. Give me those rerolls. Okay, let's, let's do this. Where where are we? We don't have anything to take, so that's not really gonna help us. Select like one domain, including boss, copy the current domain, onto the domain. I don't think there's anything really I could even want in my selections on my dice. I think. Yeah, because I don't have any like combat bonus dice. So that was kind of kind of a waste, actually. Unfortunately, because I got rid of that transaction domain, which was really bad. That was really bad. Like that was probably the, one of the biggest mistakes. But you know what? It's fine. It's fine. We will be fine. Who are we fighting? That is the big question. Kakolia can't be frozen, and I don't want to fight Kakolia. I'm just gonna say it right now. I don't want to fight Kakolia. Uh, so we're gonna go fight Sfarog. The enemy gets nihility. Uh, whatever. That's fine. I'm gonna fight Sfarog. Um. We could we could do a bring silver wolf kind of situation here because if we if we bring silver wolf we nuke him down we actually we actually are able to break him you know the nuke down strategy that we've we've done in the past this is like a a big teller of what what how this will go I think. But who do I replace in that scenario? It's all about killing the enemy as fast as possible. Because I have, right now, Hua Hua is the only one who's breaking. Do I replace Ronme? I think I replace Ronme. Ron I think we replace Ronme with Silver Wolf in this scenario. Because we can roll Quantum or Imaginary, which will allow us to break the enemy. Uh, faster, which is really important in this fight, I feel. They can't see me. But they can't the first see. phase could complete, be completely wiped by Ron here. And Huo Huo could just be our breaker. Or I could replace Fushuan and just keep keep, keep Huo Huo. Oh, what makes the most sense? What gets us through this fight? Because this boss has a lot of health. Oh, has the energy. You know what? We're gonna we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna do the silver wolf strat. It's never let us down at this stage before, so we're gonna we're gonna do that. We're gonna try it. We're gonna try. We're gonna give our best bet. And if it doesn't work out, it doesn't work out. But I I feel like this is this is how we usually get through these is with the silver wolf strat. So here we go. Welcome to the stream. Back to stream fluffs. Here we go. I think with this association, breaking is so important. Right? Oh my god. He almost immediately killed us. That's not good. Please. Okay, adding quantum is fine. Keep that up. And up. No, we need to generate a skill point. I don't know if we're going to survive. Yeah, we're not going to survive the damage. If anybody gets hit twice, they're dead. Power 
and the fact that we got the energy drain right off the start is so terrible. This frog's gonna get another turn. Are you shitting me right now? We're dead. We're so dead. Yep. He came back to life, but then he attacked him twice. We're dead. God damn it. You know what? No. Fuck that. Fuck that. Oh no, my game crashed. Alright, that was that was clearly not the strat, so we'll, we'll try again with uh with Fushuan here. Or with uh Silver Wolf or Ron May, I think is probably the best way to actually do it. That way we could get something, something other than um just that on the break, because we need breaks really importantly. Adjusting calculation, execute annihilation. Of course, she has to get a turn, mind you. Time for a plan. <laughs> this one. Oh my god. This game. This game literally... What is the RNG on this bullshit right now? Seriously, what the fuck? Why are they only attacking? Why is every attack gone to Silverwolf? What the fuck? Why did like three of the attacks go to Silverwolf? She has the lowest aggro in this team. The lowest. Like literal lowest. I'm actually, I'm so mad right now. I'm so mad right now. Okay, we need to do a lot of like, we need to do a lot of like damage control right now. Um. She's gonna get another turn, so we'll do that. Wolf well, was also gonna get another turn, but we need to fucking heal people. So, all things in this creation. Heaven search. I'm gonna do a free bunch. I'm gonna get us the old. Hello, Skull. Welcome to the stream. You are currently witnessing a lot of problems. <laughs> I'm gonna summon more. This motherfucker. This phase as soon as possible. Holy shit! No matter. This combat needs optimizing. This is double speed. Get broke, please. Thank you. The time no, to change. That's fine. Heaven, for him. Another one of these. We're gonna go for a double attack here. We have his ultimate. Failure to fail eight hours? Yeah, that was what it was last time. Hasn't been quite eight hours yet. This one ultimate. An increased attack. Okay, he just immediately lost that phase. That's... Oh god. Please don't die. I should totally finally be hitting Pushon. Can we immediately get those turns. It's great. Another 30 minutes. Yeah. Another 30 minutes. Stop with those. Cool. We took enough energy there though, so that we don't miss. Jesus. It's so important that we play this. Um, oh, you know what? That's fine, actually. We're going to defense down you now. I am going to have him just normal basic attack. 
I did this in the wrong order again, because I wasn't expecting the energy regen, but it's fine. We'll do this. And then this. And these are all imaginary, so this actually works out perfectly for us. And you all three break at the same time. Fuck this phase. Holy shit. Okay, um, recast your skill, please. Please, basic attack. Give us more energy back again. Basic attack. We'll do... Two. There's always two. He died. Awesome. Oh, Sorok didn't die. That's not good. Um, we're going to skill again, because ultimate. So it's so important that she is able to skill almost every turn at this point, basically. Um, just for the energy regen. There we go. Next phase. Cool. Okay, who's the hand gonna grab? 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 Hand gonna grab? Hand gonna grab? Fushuan, of course. Why am I not surprised? Let's try to break that shit. Um, we have to do this. That's so shitty. Oh my god, I have to. In order to survive the situation, I actually need to do this to break it out, break her out of there. Yeah. Okay, now it's dissociated. We can do a three punch here. She has to use a skill. She has to use her ultimate. He'll be there to use his weapon. Yeah, he will. Can we do this again? And then we're gonna do this again. And then we're gonna do this. It would be so much better if he had imaginary weakness, but I just can't afford to wait that long, basically. So I need to get the damage out as much as possible now. We're gonna do a two punch. On his turn. Oh, he got frozen! He did get frozen! Yes! He got frozen. That's so good. We're gonna generate a skill point. This is actually good. This is really good. This is really good. Okay. So we use Huo Huo's... We use Huo Huo's heal to get the heal and the cleanse on every turn. Hopefully get imaginary. That would be the best case scenario. Best case scenario actually is imaginary. Um, but getting quantum over there is fine too. Cool. So we have to do this again where we use Huo Huo. Um, I'm going to have to use her skill here to get the break. Which is kind of fine. Which means I can actually do this over here to get more break on him. Then I can use his basic, then his ultimate, then Hulkla's ultimate to get an attack increase in energy, and it might even give Hushuan enough energy. It did not, that's okay. We're gonna do the full skill combo. He is frozen this time, which is super good again, because that thing gets delayed even longer. We only have to deal with that, which is fine. We immediately got the energy for this. She will immediately heal for her ultimate of it, and then she will get the proc of it again. Hoha still has her skill up for Titan Pants with basic attack, and then we will use it. I probably should have healed him, actually. I probably should have healed Silver Wolf to get the full thing there. We're going to hopefully get imaginary. Okay, Quantum's fine. Needs okay, we're gonna break him. Hail servers are up. All right, cool. Um, we're gonna do this. I'm gonna give him an immediate turn. We are going to. We're gonna one punch. We're just going to use it. We're gonna use it all right here. He is so low right now. This is the best time to do this while he is frozen, and hopefully he stays frozen for a little while. This is perfect. This is good. Yes! Let's go! Oh, the quantum break into the dissociation just fucking wrecked him. Let's go. Holy shit. That was so hard. <laughs> like, I'm so glad I switched out Rod May for Silver Wolf. Holy shit. Oh my god. Holy crap. Yeah, I couldn't, I could not, yeah. Now it could not risk the the other way around. Okay. So, Celestial Annihilation is really good for those those constant turns. Let's get some more path buffs. Okay. We didn't get a lot of path buffs for that, but that's okay. Flip through the Sanguine book. Follow her trail. Criticize her. I don't 
I don't know. Uh, I am her accomplice. Oh, I exist. Cool. Oh, we actually got through that. Oh my god. I'm so like... <laughs> like... Ugh. Okay, that's actually super good though. The Celestial Annihilation is going to help us a lot. Especially with the freezes and everything. Oh, are we getting a transaction domain right at the beginning? Yes! Uh, I don't care. That's, that's fine. We'll do the adventure domain one. Yes. This is so good. This is so good. Okay. Hopefully there's actually some good shit in here though. That's the other problem, right? Um, Imperishable. I'll take that. Uh, Sure, just more damage. Uh, Aversion. Doing more damage. Uh, more attack. Uh, basic attack increases speed. Uh, we speed at the beginning of the fight. Uh, get attack based on HP we lost. Uh, crit based on that as well. Um, and if we're hit, we do find... Sure, let's take it up. Just buy it all. Just buy it all. I was good with that. I'm good with that. We buy it all. And then... Um... You know what? Yes, I want Destructible Augers to appear more frequently because I need to be able to recover stuff. So let's put Ronmei back in the team. Silver Wolf was, was, was just fucking super key in that. Super key in that. And then playing, learning to play around Fushuan, just getting that uh, getting that, that skill up is super important. I don't think I even have her on an energy recharge rope. I have her on an HP rope. She might actually be better served on an energy recharge rope. But I think we're, I think we're doing fine with the rotation as it is, so... So they're going to turn it into a combat domain. I don't really want to do that. We have five movement. We have four movement in here. Do I want to get go down and then up? Like go down, get a get a get a good reward, and then go up. Because at this point, or do I just go? Right. Let's re roll this. Let's see if we get something good here. Select one domain. Copy. Select a domain to two random locations. Nope. 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 I didn't. I didn't want to. I didn't want to take that because what's going to end up happening is. Um, Wait, could I just copy this to two random locations? And apply knowledge effect? I don't know why I did that, but you know what? Fuck it. Um, I don't know why I did that, but whatever. We'll just fucking go. <laughs> that's a mistake as well, but it's fine. You know what? It's it's the opposite of what I was talking about, but that's okay. Because you know what? This means I can go here to the downloader and uh, maybe get another character. You know, get as many characters as I possibly can and have all the options. Grab Locha. Let's upgrade our enhancements now. Fuck it. Um, honestly, Celestial Annihilation and Imperishable Victory need to be leveled up. Um, there's a couple other ones that I think would definitely be really helpful in the level up. This one, really good. This one, really good. More and max HP. Coming back up with more HP. Uh, weakness breaking the enemy delays their action more. Uh, more HP. Just leveling up a bunch of the smaller ones because they're just really good. And then more basic attack damage nine times. That's, that's fine with me. Yeah, that's good. Um, I don't even care because I already I already upgraded right like that's that's fine actually, I we already did the upgrade it's totally fine we can just go through the adventure domain and just just fucking see what we get right. Oh, it's this one. Oh god, I fucking hate this one. Okay, because we're basically not gonna get any better than where we are right now. To be honest. Okay, okay this one will stop after three rotations. So that means that this one will stop after four rotations. Oh, I got it right. Okay. Three rotations. So three before it. One, two, three. Yes! Got it right. I've never actually got this one completed. <laughs> we did it.
It means we got a curio as well, which means there might be a good a good curio in there. Oh wait, we got yeah. What? Oh, I thought we got okay. It's not chests. It's uh, a currents. So many more loneliness. Obtain three and obtain one blessing of three star rarity. Um, I'm gonna take Imperial uh, Fooly. And then we get the other one too. Oh, okay, that's super good. Cosmic Altruist. Oh, I don't have the Cosmic Fragments. No, that sucks. That sucks. That sucks. That super, super sucks. Okay. Um, I mean, they're both adventure domains left. So it's like kind of whatever. Um, will you generate three random beacons in random domains? Okay. I mean, we might as well just do both adventures and then, you know what? No, no, let's not get any more. Let's not get crazy. Let's just do the last adventure and just go. Cause we already, we already got the, the other one. And, um, oh, this is an easy one. This is actually a super easy one. I am going to grab, um, I don't know who I'm going to grab. I'm going to grab, I'm going to, I'm going to, what are the elements in here do I not have with me right now? I don't have fire. So we'll grab Asta. Let's just, let's just grab Asta. That's another element we don't have. I should be able to finish this with just Fushuan, though. I have less time. Oh no, I missed the lip! I miss if I didn't miss that lip, I would have got it actually, because she's really good at this map. Damn. Turned a little too tight. Turned a little too. Oh <gasps> yes. Yeah. Oh, this one's really good too. Fuck, these are both really good. Fuck. Uh removed association deal equal each with equal damage. No, no, fuck that. This was, that's the damage. So we still kinda went remembrance path basically, but with propagation. It's effectively what we're we're doing right now. Sag World, thank you very much for the follow. I appreciate that. Welcome to the Moving Shakers. I mean, the boss really copy the current domain onto the. I mean, that doesn't matter. Let's use all our rerolls, see what happens. We have no. We're on the last one anyway, so it doesn't. We're in a common domain. Oh, wait, no, that's actually really good. We need that. Actually, I should have kept that one. That would be really good for us. Crap, I should have kept that one. That would actually. That's actually what we needed. Yes! Because when we enter this domain, um, we'll get a, we'll get a blessing, I think. Maybe. No, we didn't. Argenti. Oh, the swarm. The swarm. Okay, no. Fuck that. Fuck Argenti. We're going for the swarm. We're going for the we're going for the swarm. We're going for the swarm. Propagation. Path of propagation. Fighting the swarm. We're doing it. We're doing it. Okay. Okay. Okay, so we have reached the end of probably one of the best runs I've ever had in here. Like a godly tier run. So let's look. Let's go over our characters and our comp one more time. Alright, so we got Hua Hua. We've got her light cone. We've got her traces. Almost, you know, 8 out of 10. We've got maxed out relics. We've got her at E0, but we have the cheese, so she'll be E1. Which means she'll have three stacks of her effect, right? Cool. We've got Fushuan. We've got her light cone. We've got her traces. I have not leveled these up, though I'm cons I have considered it. Um, max relics uh, on a two-piece two -piece set. Eidolons are also 0, but she will be E1 because we have the cheese. Ron May, level 80, Memories of the Past, S5, Traces, Relics, Maxed, Eidolons, E1, she'll be E2 because of the, uh, because of the cheese, all right? Daniel, level 80, Light Cone, Traces, Relics, Maxed, Eidolons, E2, he'll be E3 because of the cheese. This is our, this is our team comp. We're not going to bring Silver Wolf in this, we're going to use Ron May uh, for this one uh, because the enemy, all the enemies are weak to... Quantum imaginary area and the main enemy is weak to ice and they'll be delayed longer, which is really good. Uh, for buffs, we have for buffs we have three preservation buffs: uh, the quake one, the sta a shield anytime we take damage based on the HP we lost. That's pretty good crit rate, which is kind of whatever. Um, uh, we have the applied dissociation, which is super good. When attacking friends, applied dissociation, super good. Uh, we have basically all three of the uh, Remembrance Path buffs. We also have, when attacking the enemy with the Dissociation, it removes the Dissociation effect. Um, 
And then we have a chance to freeze them for the first time we reduce their HP below 50. And then when they're frozen or whatever, which is dissociation, they get 36% more damage. We have the break, weakness break efficiency, which is super good because we have Ron May. So we're basically getting like a, a 95 increase to efficiency. We're nearly, nearly doubling our weakness break efficiency. Uh, when we inflict that weakness, it's applied to everybody. So that's super good for like quantum and imaginary weaknesses because that means it'll delay everybody's actions. And then we just have this random like extra damage from wind shear and uh, um, burn shock bleed effects, right? We have the abundance for like, we have some of the abundant stuff. So for the chart, the dewdrop will be doing extra damage, right? Um, dewdrop will break. It'll also remove debuffs from us, which is super important. Uh, when we provide healing to our allies, they will both units will gain 50% attack, which is super good for our main DPS because he will actually provide healing through propagation and things like that. Though I don't think it works on that against specifically Huo Huo. We'll provide attack to both everybody, but with Huo Huo's effect or Fu Xuan's effect, it will it will always hit the target we want to hit. Uh, we'll deal extra damage based on our HP. Uh, being healed by an ally will store more HP. And then we have more HP based on how many abundance effects we have, which is one, two, three, four, five. So we'll get you know get uh, five to so thirty five percent more HP, which is super 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 good, right? Um, hunt we have imperishable victory and celestial annihilation both enhanced, which means we'll be getting those constant action forwards that we need so much to make sure we just kill the thing before it can even attack us, right? Flowing mist for even. Uh, more attack and another chance to get skill points back, which we super need because we're using Daniel. And then we also have another action advance forward from the this one. And then weakness break, delaying the enemy action by 30% and then speed at the very beginning of the fight. And then the two most important destruction ones, in my opinion, um, the if we die, a character comes back at 30% HP, which is super good. And then 24% more max HP on them, which is super good. We have no elation buffs. We only have 12 propagation buffs. We did not get nearly enough propagation buffs in my opinion as far as like the one stars i think we got all three no we got um uh we got the formation and then we got the the interplay right and then we got the metamorphosis for frozen so a chance to freeze enemies on a tempers attack hello nana welcome back to stream and then uh for each kill point recovered apply one spore and then scythe limbs for more crit damage and then basic attack We'll do more AOE damage and then more basic attack damage based on what we have. And then more HP regen. Anytime a character consumes a skill point, they will get HP back, which is super important. More crit rate, which we didn't really need, actually. Um, and defense and speed stats anytime we use basic attack, right? Super, super good. So we have elation and um, erudition were actually the paths that we, we, we said we didn't want. Because we don't have any follow-up attackers. And a lot of things that elation does, destruction kind of does. Like it has a revive in there and the energy regen is nice. But I prefer some of the destruction buffs. So... And then Curios, we have the Cuckoo Clock, which means one character is just going to get attacked a lot. Um, we've been getting tons of fragments from Black Hole Trap. We never actually proc this. was actually, in my opinion, is a good thing. Um, we used this a couple times. We got the Space Cheese. Uh, we're not going to have any energy at the beginning of the fight, which is going to suck. Okay? It's going to absolutely be terrible. We're going to have act more action advance forward. I ended up fucking up my transaction domain plan with this, so that just ended up being terrible. Um, this affects the uh, the abundance and propagation buffs we have, so we technically have one more, so we have six for that one and, like, seven or eight for that one, for the propagation one, and then six for the abundance one. This will actually give us 30% more damage from the one carrier that's broken. Uh, we got rerolls at one point, adventure domain, more blessings, and then this one, so... This, this is what we got. So we don't have we don't have the healing curio. We don't have the extra damage curio uh, as far as like the initial damage attack. We don't have any of that stuff. We are max technique points. You've seen the characters. You see what we've got. Um, I think that's I think that's everything, right? Uh, we used inspiration. We used all of these effects. I kind of messed. There was like a lot of mistakes that I made in the second phase and the very end of the last phase. But you know what? It's fine. We're here. This is going to be I don't know what the millionth try for this shit. Um, this is probably one of my best runs, even though it actually doesn't, it kind of doesn't feel like it, but at the same time it does. Uh, I'm not going to bring Silver Wolf. We're just going to use, we're going to use what we have. We're going to use what we got and we're, we're going to bring it down. I'm going to be listening to music over here, but I'm not going to put music on the stream because I need to actually be able to record this and I don't want music to be like in the things. So I'm going to go ahead and find me a good, a good hype song for myself. You know, the one I've been listening to for uh, days now, actually, because it's been stuck in my fucking head. Um, um, I actually, I'll listen to her other one. I'm gonna listen to the. I'm gonna listen to. The, I'm gonna listen to. Uh, I don't know, not that one. No, 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 no. You know what? Let's listen to God's League of Legends. I'm listening to it in the background just because you guys are curious. 
No problem for being late, Nana. You got here just in time to uh, to see everything. In fact, I will I will put chat back on the screen. So if you guys decide to uh, uh, to talk uh, reasonably, uh, it'll be there in the bottom corner. <laughs> yeah. I don't think you guys can hear the music, but if you can, let me know. But I don't think you should be able to. So, all right, here we go. Sound I'm so I'm so nervous right now. You can? Okay, let me find out. You, you know what? I don't. You know what? I don't. You know what? I don't fucking care. You know what? I'm gonna. I'll turn it on normally then. Fuck it. Gods is what we need for this because uh, that's what I said. That's what I, that's what I said. I'm gonna turn it on now then. Conflict requires undivided focus. There we go. I don't care. I'll just record it with it in there, and uh, if League of Legends will supply me with the I did not mean to do that, but you know what? It's okay. It's okay. I had to click back on the screen, and so it just did the attack, but that's okay. I'm actually going to use her skill here. I'm going to use her skill here. So it actually worked out. Um, I'm going to use her skill again to get a refresh on this. And uh, I'm going to use a basic. Sent a storm. He was so delayed that he didn't do anything. I'll use her skill again. Make sure she gets as much energy as possible before this shit pops off. Every petal will be swept His nihility buff is about to come out as well. But thankfully, it doesn't do any initial damage. It does damage on her turns, which is fine. Basic. Use her skill. Remember what we said about Daniel and his two 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 skill, right? We we play it we play a little safer. We do a two skill, get the energy, then we start going. We didn't get enough propagation buffs to get two of the effects, but that's okay. We do this. We do this. Give him another turn. There's no buffs that are going to be needed to be refreshed. So we can do a three pinch, and then he will. Weakness break the enemy, and then we'll actually just generate a, generate two skill points. Uh, one basic attack, two skill. Pushwan will. I'm gonna ult again on Pushwan, or I'm gonna skill again on Pushwan because I want to get I want to get her to as high as possible for um, for that skill, right? For her. Uh, as many stacks of her passive as possible, so I don't have to worry about it as we're going through later on. If it if it seems like I'm being like overly cautious, right? It's because I've been grinding this for like two fucking weeks. Okay, I need this to work because I'm tired of trying. <laughs> I'm gonna lose my goddamn mind. Okay. Like, I, like, it's just, it's, it's so aggravating. I'm going to lose my goddamn mind. Um. I'm going to actually use basic over here, which should pop that dude, which will give her Celestial Annihilation, which will give her another skill point, which will be cool. And she'll give her another skill point. Alright, we're going to do this. Should break him. Means we can do a three punch. Yep. There we go. Can do a basic. Can do a basic. So the great thing about again the great thing about Fushuan and uh, Fuhua in this scenario is they keep cleansing us, right? Like they, they to get the two them two of them together end up doing a lot of cleansing. For the, for the team. I'm gonna proc this. I'm not gonna get all the skill points back from this, but it's okay. I don't want them to get more turns than, than is necessary. Um, we can... We're gonna two punch. We did not break, but we're gonna get another turn. We will break, which will give us another turn. We will two punch. We don't need to generate much energy. Then we will ult, which will give us another turn. 
We also don't have Auspicious Star, I just realized that for like energy regen, right? So we're missing actually some of the like really good shit. I am going to... I'm going to take this turn to just recast Ron May's ability, even though we have another turn. And I'm also going to recast the first. And uh, I'm going to do basic for this. And then... I'm going to do another basic attack. And Nihility is like not as much of a problem with this team. You get the turn. Every petal all will be swept away. Ron May ultimate. There's more to life. It shows the in-game music on <laughs> during this. It is, it's like underneath that I can hear it kind of. I'm just gonna turn it off. <laughs> uh, I'm actually gonna make her a base attack over here. Did not kill. That's okay. The strength. You only need two. So we're just trying to kill the others because he'll get he'll get um not celestial annihilation but imperial rain or whatever it is to get an extra turn. Yeah. So just jitter to skill point and that should kill. It did not. Um. All things I this world didn't have to do that. Fuck. Okay, that was a waste. That was an actual. That was just a straight waste. Um, in the context of, like, the damage from it, right? That was just a waste. I could have got a lot of breaks on a, a, a bunch of enemies for this guy. We'll recast. We're getting extra turns. It's fine. All right, we're just going to have to take this damage for a minute. Okay, that guy needs to die. We cannot afford at all for that to just be a thing. Oh, my God. She almost got one shot. Thank God for some shields. Wait, what? He immediately got to blow- Whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay, they're getting way too many turns. Fuck that. Get, get, fuck, fuck, fuck that. They're getting way too many turns. Holy shit. Oh, like, that was- That was not okay. That was not okay. That was, like, not okay at all. That almost fucked us so hard. Holy shit. Fuck you, game. We're- Three punch. Three punch. Three punch. Extra energy. Like, Fushuan went down so hard just now. That is not okay. Um... Like, at all. It's like, that's not cool. Every We're gonna do this. All will be swept away by the wind. We're gonna do this. We have to do a lot here. We have to do a lot. Um, I'm gonna recast this up. The resonance comes out. And I have to actually take Daniel's turn. I actually am gonna have to take Daniel's turn. I'm gonna pop, pop this. Pop Daniel's turn. Pop this. Because otherwise he's gonna, he's gonna do his full attack on us. We just can't allow that to happen. That'll break several of them. She will get another turn. I'm actually going to use her skill again. Because uh, Daniel is going immediately after that. And then Daniel can do uh, a two punch to break. Which will do a ton of damage. And then he can do a three punch for all the skill points? No, because Ron May is going to have to regenerate. But if he does one point, he might kill this guy. Which will actually give him, a, which will actually give him an action forward. Perfect. Which means then we can do a, do a one punch here. No, it didn't kill. However, we recast we recast Ron May. We run Daniel. And then we can do a three punch for Daniel, which will kill one of them off the side, which will give him another action. And then we can generate a skill point. I mean, Spushan can recast this again to heal. Uh, generate energy. Basic attack. Get another passive up. Cool. Oh, it's so important we keep these passives up. Thank God for all the cleanses, because these dots would actually murder us. Yeah, just skill. Just skill and heal. We're gonna do a two punch. So it kills the side one, he gets another action, right? We do a one punch, I think it'll give it enough energy. We ultimate, which gives us another action, which we can three punch here. Basic. 
immediately activate this as that's coming up because we can get Daniel out there with a three punch after this. Ooh, and I have a debuff coming up. There are so many turns coming up. Okay. I don't have to do that many. I can actually just do one. He will get another turn. Yes. Perfect. You can do one. One punch. Just one punch is all across. One punch is all across. He gets all the energy. They got broken. No. We can do a basic to generate. Then ultimate. Because so they don't get any turns. And then we can triple punch because we have four blocks. Which is a shit ton to hit. With that energy back. He's doing so much damage. Oh my god. This fucking, this fucking thing is doing so much. Okay, he's getting in his berserk mode now. But we're gonna we're gonna weakness break him for sure. For sure, for sure. I hope. No, I hope anyways. Come on, gods. Gods. Everybody everybody say it with me, gods. <laughs> Like my ability is getting worse. It applies five wind bleeds when it procs. That is so nuts right now. That is so nuts. Five wind bleeds. Skill. She hadn't had a turn in a while. Oh, they're delayed further. Perfect. One skill will give him an action. The times are changed. Heaven search. We three skill. I don't. We can two skill. We can two skill and then we But we only had to do one skill because I actually just fucked that up. I just generated a skill. It's fine. It's fine. I want these guys low, but I don't want them dead. If that makes sense. That probably doesn't make sense. You'll see. You'll see what I mean. Oh, she has another point. Uh, okay. Oh man, that shit is really starting to stack up and hurt. It hurts so much. She does not have the energy for this. Heal. Poor boy just has to heal more. All washed over by diamonds. Oh my god. Okay, I can't let them have all those turns. Nope. Can't let it happen. I cannot let it happen. I can literally cannot let them have all those turns. We also have the debuff dispeller from like the uh, the the which the uh, which as well. So we're gonna we're gonna triple skill here. Okay, we go to the next phase. That actually might be bad. Oh, but he's immediately blowing up and getting vulnerabilities on him. Get another turn. We'll just do one skill. Perfect. Um, we do a skill. We let him summon his dude. Then we do this. We're going to get another turn regardless. We want to blow that one up. Perfect. Oh, so I'll crush them all. oh my gosh, you took so much damage. Heaven search. Quick. Okay. Who's probably gonna die? Some value, I suppose. Oh, those dots are immediately procking, by the way, now. I just noticed that. They're immediately procking. Oh my god, she lived. She lived. Okay, this is this is the key. Please, Fushuan. Please, Fushuan. Yes. Your ultimate's gonna break a ton of them. That's fine. That's fine. You're gonna get an action. That's fine. You're gonna heal. Get an action. And, um... Wait, who's about to go? Who's, which one's this? That's this one? That's this one. Okay, this one hasn't done his thing yet. Um... Do I skill again to get the energy and reset the buff? Oh no, so basic attack, get the energy, she'll get another turn. And then we do this, and we do this to get Daniel, Daniel a turn. We immediately go over here. We do, we're gonna have to do a triple punch. We're gonna have to do a double punch here. 
Yeah, we have to do a double punch here because we cannot let we cannot let this guy get through. It's just not that's not an option. Um, and we need as many turns as possible. Uh, we need to break this guy. So we will do. He's not going to break. Uh, he'll break if we do. Hold on a second. He will break with one one attack and then we'll launch everybody forward. Thank you. Oh hell yeah. Okay. Let me go back over here and nearly break him. Or do we do a basic attack into ultimate? Basic attack and ultimate to generate a skill. Use the ultimate to get another action forward. Save that break, actually. Save that break. Uh, go over here. Do a triple. Kill these guys. Kill these guys. Yeah, we save that break for when we need more. We need to action forward again. Basically, we need everybody to action forward again. We get Ron Might Ultimate off. Um. She will not break, which is fine, but it guarantees that she will. Yeah, we'll do that. All the dots come out again. Fushuan will break here. Perfect. We will cast her skill. We will hold on to that ultimate for a moment. Um. We use Daniel to hopefully kill one of these. The free punch. Yes. Yes. With a kill, he gets another turn. He can do one skill. He might get enough energy. Yes. He kills that one, which does another energy again. You go on the middle. He gets another turn. We don't need to. Do we need a triple punch? Will it kill with just the two? Wait, he's getting another turn regardless right now. Hold on a second. Yes, yes. Okay, we can just do another. We can do a. S will this kill? I don't think this will kill. I'll risk it. We'll do one. We'll do one. Yes. Okay, killed. Get an action forward. And we can triple punch. Um, Ron May's good. She's good. Yeah, we can triple. Punch. Um, mm, I kind of feel like I need to cleanse. Yeah, we need to cleanse. We need to cleanse. We're just gonna heal. We're gonna heal. We're gonna take the skill points there and heal. Because they're all gonna get delayed, I think. Yes. But one of them. Yes. 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 Let's go. Okay. Uh, we're gonna have to just generate. This is gonna be a generating skill points turn. Um. Ooh. Ooh. No. We wait. We wait. We wait. We want the. We want the other actions. Skill point. Heal. We want them to summon more. There. Bam. We immediately use his skill. Go. Ultimate. Okay. We ultimate there. We generate a skill point here. We generate a skill point here. Or we don't generate. We just kill. Right? And then he's still delayed. We can three punch this guy with the two we have left. Right, we can three punch this guy. We can ultimate with Fushuan to get a little bit more on there. We basic into this for that. Then we Fush let me Huo Huo ult for this. Ron may ult again, so they're all the, so all these guys will be delayed except for the big dude again. Well, the big dude actually will get delayed again because we have to. He's been broken once before already, so we will we will break him with a two punch, which will give us an ult, which actually would have gave us a turn anyway. So this is actually a waste to use an ult. Here. That was a mistake. Okay, that's one mistake. It's fine. It's not going to be the end of the world because we can we can we can like guarantee a kill here if we actually. I think we three punch this. We still kill the sides. I'm pretty sure we still kill the sides. Yes. Cool. We three punch that dude. He breaks and breaks. We two punch. We two punch. We two punch. We two punch because we're trying to save a skill point. At least one skill point. Uh, even though we didn't actually really need to because everybody's at their max stacks right now, it's fine. Basic attack. Um, 
Basic attack. We're fine. We're fine. We're basic attacking right now. We're we're basic attacking. We are basic bitches right now. We basic. He's gonna finally get that wrong. Oh, he didn't. Oh, he was already delayed once. That's right. No, oh, that's bad. That's bad. We don't have another turn. Oh, but Fushuan has a heal. That's fine. All right, we're gonna we're gonna heal. Can't afford anybody to die right now. Um, he immediately procked his shit over here. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I don't like you doing that. Freeze. Maybe, Maybe get lucky and get a freeze there. No. Um, basic over here. Immediately, immediately pop that. Immediately pop that because we need. Oh, it's not gonna break that one, but it'll break this one. We'll break that one. It's fine. Yeah, you're doing your shit. That's fine. You do your shit, buddy. Um, I'm gonna do a triple, a triple punch here, which should kill this guy, which will give me another turn. And I have the the what's call buff that doesn't work. It didn't give me no. Did I not kill him? It didn't. Oh my god, it did not kill him. That's insane. Okay. That's all right. Oh no, I don't want her to get the extra turn. Fuck. No, she's gonna get the extra turn. It's fine. Well, we'll all get action if Oh no, we did. She didn't get the extra. Damn, that thing is surviving. I don't like that. We can do a two punch, and this one should, this one should die. He is still not. He's not low. But we're gonna get another action when we kill this guy and break that dude, so we'll get a bunch of damage. Cool. And we're gonna kill the other big one. Like right now. Like we do a triple punch. We do a double punch here. We kill the big one, and we get enough energy. Does a shit ton of damage. We ultimate. Full hold. For extra damage. We... Yeah, we do a triple punch. Triple punch. Breaks. We get another turn. We basic attack. Kill. Yes! Kill that one. We triple punch to kill this one, which gives us the energy. We ultimate to go in again, and we fucking kill this bitch. Fucking finally, let's go. Please, please let this be the end. Let this be the end. Please, to all the gods in the world, please let this be fucking it, okay? I am done with this shit. Get me out of here, please. Ronme, for the finish, please, please. Please, Ronmei, for the f kill this fucking bug. Everything someone kill the bug. Someone kill this fucking bug. I don't care who does it. Someone kill this fucking bug. Fushuan, you know what, Fushuan? You have been the star of this. Kill this fucking bug. Thank you. Holy shit, let's go. Woo! Oh my god, it took so long. It took so long. It took one run. One run to get this shit done. Holy shit. Was the Berserk limit up there? I didn't even see it. Was it really? Oh my god. Oh shit. Oh god. Oh. God, that's insane. I'll have to look back at the, I'll look back at the bot. I'm so, I'm so. Woo. We did it. We did it. We fucking, we did it. We've defeated Conundrum 12 with Propagation with the same team I've used this whole fucking time. We didn't really use any like, like super cheese strats outside of like getting a bunch of turns, right? We just, we had, if like, if I didn't every round, if I didn't kill the targets in like attack their weakness in the right order every time, that was over. At any point in time, if they got too many fucking turns, it was fucking over. No capitalism strat needed. Well, the funny part is, like, I'm aware of that strat, but I've not actually watched any, like, videos or anything like on it. So, because I, I was trying to avoid doing anything, like, one that anybody, like, had really done before or that I, like, I didn't want anything to influence how I was doing this. I'm going to go watch all that shit now so I can know all those strats. But, like, I just, I just wanted, I just wanted to, I wanted to beat it with propagation, okay? I wanted to do this with my Daniel, my E2 Daniel, my built team. And like, I just, I just fucking wanted to do it. Okay. I just, I needed it. All right. I needed it. Okay. I want to point out that this run, my, I turned my record on to record this run, right? It is now just hit a hundred, just hit an hour and 50 minutes. Okay. 
So it took us nearly two hours to get through this whole run because of how much I was just like trying to make sure we got this because we didn't have any anything. All we had was Ron May, Extra Turns, and Daniel E2, which for some people, if you're watching this on YouTube and you're watching this on Twitch right now, and you're like, ah, you have E2, you you had E, you basically had E1 and E3 on every character because you're a whale and all this stuff. Fuck you, I earned this shit, okay? This was fucking hard, all right? This was ridiculously hard for me trying to get through this. I, and maybe it's a skill issue, I don't fucking care. I earned this win and I'm taking it home with me, all right? So there you go. That's right, and a dream, that's right. That's all I needed in a dream. Oh my God. Colossus, the Forbidden Project. I'm assuming that's the ch achievement for it. You deserve it. Thank you. Breathe. Ooh, I'm trying to breathe. I'm trying to breathe. It's... God, I... You guys saw it. Two weeks I've been grinding this shit out. Two weeks I've been grinding this shit out. Trying to get this one perfect run to just get it done. Oh, God. Oh. My hands are literally... My hands are literally, like, shaking. I'm like, um... Whoo! I love that. I love that shit. I love that. That that was a feeling. So that I just want to describe the feeling a little bit. The f the feeling of like having to work out everything to get that done just right is like when I was back. It reminded me of the days of raiding in World of Warcraft and like Final Fantasy, right? And Star and Star Wars: The Old Republic of my raiding days, where you're just you got that one percent. You got that one percent where you're just you're just trying to get that last percent to get that fucking kill to get shitty loot, but to get that fucking kill and that achievement, and it just. Oh, it feels so good. It just... <sighs> well, YouTube, uh, that is going to be the end of this video, probably. I've got to edit all this shit up so I can so I can put it up on 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 fucking uh, on YouTube and everything along those lines. I'm gonna have to edit it out. I'm gonna put the whole fucking thing up there. I, it's it's basically almost two hours. I'm gonna put the whole thing up there because it's I. I talked throughout the entire thing of everything that I was trying to do to get this run done, okay? So, yeah. And I, the highlights for me right now, just to discuss it a little bit before I continue on. Uh, um, uh, Sagro, thank you for the follow. I don't know if I had said that. Um, uh, what's, uh, what not saying, thank you for the follow. I appreciate, appreciate that. Um, the, the peak, the big key points here, by the way, were the dissociation for damage. Right, we really needed, like, even with the dissociation, the boss was still, like, fucking living forever, right? We needed the dissociation for the crowd control, mostly, the freeze effects, right? We needed the weakness break, we needed Celestial Annihilation to be able to get more turns, especially since I didn't get another, I didn't get enough propagation buffs to have two procs of the propagation um, bonuses, right? Um, Daniel E2 is fucking key for this. If you didn't have Daniel E2, it doesn't work. It just doesn't work at all because then you just don't get the extra turns and you don't get the extra uh, the extra damage, right? You don't get the, the free extra skill point because skill point management was so... You guys saw me, but like, I miscalculated my, po my points like twice and it just almost killed the whole run, right? Like, missing out on skill points like twice was almost killed the whole run. In fact, at the end of there, I had miscalculated and nobody was buffed anymore. So <laughs> that's why it, one, it took like three basic attacks to kill the boss because I was like totally unbuffed. From Ron May, her buff was gone, and then um, uh, I had to Fush. I basically had to Fushwan skill almost every time, right? I had like, I love this team. This team was so much fun to work with in like the context of like trying to manage skill points, even with free skill points. Um, I had none of the propagation buffs that gave me back skill points, though. I just realized that. I don't think I had any. Uh, I'll have to edit and post if I did, but I'm pretty sure I had none of the propagation buffs that actually give you more skill points. Like if you're at zero, you gain two, or if at the beginning of the term, every at the beginning of every turn for like the first five turns of characters or whatever, you get an extra skill point, um, or any of that stuff either. So I that was all tight management of that. I had to use a lot of uh, Fushuan's skill to make sure she always had her passive up, otherwise she was just dead and the fight was over. Um, there was that one point I think in the phase two where she dropped to like 64 HP and I thought I thought it was over. I think at one point she did die, I think, or maybe it was Ho-Ho. Someone died, I think. I don't know if the, I think the destruction buff popped at least once. Um, the, the, the effect that gave us a shield every time we took damage was also super key for both the crit damage, the crit rate buff we got from that, and then also just survivability, right? Because it immediately props back up every time you take the damage. And then Hoch was 
healing and her cleanse was just so huge right just massive in that fight because it just kept everybody from dying immediately to like dots because it would remove a lot of the dots and then Fushuan's buff would remove a lot of the dots so without all that extra HP and all that extra healing at the beginning of your turn and then cleansing at the beginning of the turn every turn especially for Daniel because he was just kept taking turns right super good super important for that whole build Ron Mays you guys saw it in the, I think it was in phase three Ron Mays ultimate delaying the the two big swarm guys like one more turn so i could get another like another like just another chance to break and keep going was absolutely insanely useful um it just it it that was that was crazy that was the craziest run of star wheel i've ever played and i loved every moment of it yeah little things that can affect the huge results yep one misstep and it'll ruin the momentum exactly exactly it was it that was absolutely nerve-wracking Ooh. So yeah, GG's, GG's in the chat, in the chat, and uh, if you're watching this on YouTube, please, 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 if you got here to the end and you saw the end of the run and you actually listened to my whole rant, please leave a like, subscribe to the channel. I'm going to do, I'm, I have two more runs planned, by the way. I'm not going to do them today, but I have two more runs planned. I want to do one with Jing Liu and I want to do one with my Kafka and I'm going to be doing a different, different pass for them, right? So please like, comment, and subscribe, and come on over to my Twitch. And you can watch me do these live because I'm going to be working on these a lot. Um, and uh, if you don't, uh, Ken will come to your house or and give you a cake and that says, come come watch me on Twitch.tv and YouTube and all that other stuff. That's, that's what will happen. They just jump out of your closet and just be like, oh, I'm here. And you just, you just it's, it's a whole thing. It's to be terrible. Anyways. Um, yeah, just that. Yeah, yeah, this was this was super fun. I love I love I love I love a challenge. So. Uh, keep an eye out for uh, some HSR reviews, and then also keep an eye out for, uh, like I said, a Jing Liu and a Kafka run eventually. And yeah, and I'll see you guys next time. Later.